Well, good morning. I, uh, it's um, 7.30, a little after 7.30, Saturday morning, February 10th, and I am not on the trail. I'm in the neighborhood. I'm running, I'm actually not running, I'm walking right now on the side of this road in the dirt. I, I'm, the reason I'm here is because I've been, uh, unfortunately, I've kind of run into some problems. The, the um, IT band pain that I was talking about, my knee pain, is back, and it's uh, back with a vengeance. I just, uh, it's really bothering me. I thought that I had done a little bit, uh, you know, obviously I haven't done enough to alleviate, alleviate it. And so I'm right now I'm walking because um, the pain gets so bad that I have to walk. Um, it's hard to keep pushing through it. So I walk and then I run and then I walk and then I run. I've been out here since about 5.30. I did about three miles this morning and then I went to the gym and did some uh, couple miles on the treadmill on an incline. And now I'm back out here putting in about four more miles. And uh, <sighs> I'm getting concerned because this, uh, it's really starting to bother me. My hip isn't getting much better. I've been stretching it. I've been trying to do some stretching exercises. I've been rolling out my leg with a tennis ball, trying to get that IT pain <sighs> dealt with. It's just that, 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 uh, that tendon gets really tight. And unfortunately for me, my job involves a lot of sitting, sitting at a desk on the phone, you know, and um, it's not good for your body. Human beings should not spend hours and hours and hours and hours and hours sitting every day. It's not good for you. So anyways, I've developed some issues and one of the things I haven't been talking about is that my Achilles, my left Achilles heel has been really um, bothering me. Um, it is, it's just been really painful. It started off as kind of a little bit of an annoyance and then it has progressively gotten worse. So yeah, it's, it's, it's a little discouraging. I'm a little fearful that uh, these little things are going to add up and they're going to get worse and it's going to ruin my training and uh, ruin my opportunity to meet the goal that I'm after with the Grand Canyon this year. So that makes me think of, you know, it brings me to uh, an idea, a topic that I think is worth discussing. Whenever we set goals, if those goals are really of any value, if they're really um, big goals, uh, even moderately big goals, you're gonna run into obstacles. What do you do? How do you handle those things? You know, and in my case, I'm going to keep working on it. I'm gonna keep looking for answers. I'm gonna keep trying to find ways to uh, deal with these problems. And maybe I will adjust my training approach. Maybe I'll do some other things. I'll do some cross training. I'll jump on the bike or something. Um, I don't know. Today I'm gonna to go to the running store, a running store here local um, in the valley. It's, it's a pretty good place. There's some good people there um, from what I understand. I haven't been there. I have some friends that have been there. They said it's a great place and the people really know what they're talking about. So I'm gonna go there and see, maybe I need different shoes. Maybe I need some, there's some exercises that I'm not doing, some stretches that I'm not doing. Maybe I'm making everything worse by just trying to work through it. But I just know that I need to keep training. And so that's what's going on today. I, you know, I feel really good from you know, I have energy, I have uh, my cardiovascular, uh, my heart's feeling good, my lungs feel good, and you know, all of that is great. It's just these little injuries that are really, they're just, uh, it's discouraging. <laughs> so I'm gonna keep working at it and I'll keep letting you know what in the, what's going on. And I'm hoping for the best. I am determined to continue and I will find a way. So I hope that you do the same with your goals. I hope that you keep working. I hope you keep looking for answers. I hope you don't just stop um, when you get challenges. 
And sometimes you don't get every goal. Sometimes you don't get the goal when you want it. Like I didn't make the first trip when I went out to hit the, to do the Grand Canyon. I failed the first time. It took me two years to go back and a lot of different preparation and training and uh, was able to do it. And so, you know, if you've got some goals that you're working on, I hope that you keep at it. And the, one of the things that will help you um, keep going is you develop strong reasons. Why are you wanting to do it in the first place? And remember why. When it gets tough, <clears throat> excuse me, when it gets tough, you just have to remember why am I doing this? Why do I want to do this? And those reasons will help you continue through it. So that's it for today. And I hope you're having a wonderful weekend, and I hope you keep pursuing your big goals. Talk to you later.